How does potassium affect your body? You may have wondered either of its exact purpose or how much potassium should actually be consumed. Even though it is common knowledge that potassium is important, but its importance has been highly undervalued. Especially considering that potassium intake reduces the risk of overall mortality by 20%. Not only that, it reduces risk of stroke and lowers blood pressure. So if you have ever questioned the importance of potassium, you may need to start now. Potassium is one of the most important electrolytes in the body. Being an electrolyte, it is able to dissolve in water and produce positive ions. These ions carry electrical signals, facilitating the communication in the nervous system. Almost 80% of the potassium found in the body is in the muscle cells. About 20% can be found in the bones, liver, and red blood cells. The primary functions of potassium include fluid balance, nerve signals, and muscle contraction. Water makes up a majority part of the body, with 60% of the body made up of water. The water may be present inside the cells in the form of intracellular fluid or between cells or spinal fluid as extracellular fluid. Potassium, along with sodium, is a key determinant in the amount of water found in the intracellular and extracellular fluid. Potassium plays a crucial role in maintaining the osmolality of the intracellular fluid, as it helps to create a balance between the concentration of electrolytes outside and inside a cell. It is responsible for the eventual shrinking and swelling of a cell. Fluid imbalance eventually leads to dehydration. So always remember to keep yourself hydrated and replenish your electrolytes. The nervous system would be rendered inefficient if not for the working of potassium. It plays an important role in generating nerve impulses moving out of cells. A nerve impulse is generated depending on the voltage of the cell. This voltage is controlled by the movement of ions. Thus, a change in levels of potassium ions can highly compromise the voltage produced by a cell. If the right nerve impulses are not generated, important processes like communication in the nervous system, voluntary and involuntary reflexes, and heartbeat can be affected. An abnormal heartbeat can not only affect the blood flow to various organs, but can also be fatal and lead to a sudden death. The optimal amount, according to the health authorities, of potassium intake is 3,500 to 4,700 milligrams daily. It is preferred that the required dose of potassium be taken from natural sources and not supplements. Foods rich in potassium include beans, yams, white potatoes, portobello mushrooms, avocados, and such. While consuming potassium, it must be made sure that it's not overly consumed or underconsumed, as overconsumption of potassium leads to hyperkalemia. It causes change to the heart rhythm and in extreme cases may even cause paralysis. Whereas low consumption leads to a number of health problems, this includes depleting calcium in bones, increased blood pressure, and higher chance of kidney stones. Potassium is often underlooked in diet plans, but its role in the body is too crucial to be swept under the rug. Therefore, it is of high importance that potassium be consumed in the right quantity from the right foods. We hope you are learning something new every day from our videos. If you have a question or you want us to cover a specific topic, let us know in the comment section below. You can also connect with us directly on Instagram at the Dr. Oski or subscribe to our YouTube channel, which is www.youtube.com forward slash Dr. Oski.